Hey y'all, so today I wanted to get on and do a video about fall scents. If you didn't know already, fall is my favorite, favorite, favorite season um, and when it comes to scents and things like smelling more like dessert just because it's the holidays, um, you know, it's fall, like people want like warmer scents. So a lot of things have caramel and vanilla notes in them and I just love it. So I just wanted to share with you some of my favorite fall scents. I have a lot of products right here, so I'm just going to get right to it. Um, these are not all hair products. A lot of these are body products, but some I also use on my hair. So I would say my favorite thing that I look forward to in fall, well not my favorite thing, but in terms of buying products, is when Solstice Scents come out, comes out with their fall and winter collections because the perfumes I love already, they make these awesome perfume oils and then when it's fall, it's like double double yummy. So like here I have pumpkin spice latte perfume, like what? Who does that? Amazing. Yummy. Uh, then I have Halloween night. This one smells like basically the Halloween candy aisle in the grocery store. There's a lot of like candy corn and you can smell a lot of sugar, but then there's also like chocolate and licorice mixed in. It's awesome. Uh, this one, actually I rubbed the label off, but this is Kitchen. And it's really funny that something is called Kitchen because uh, people have given me so many compliments on this perfume. They're like, what are you wearing? And I'm like, Kitchen. And it sounds weird, but it really, Kitchen meaning it smells like baked goods. So there's like croissants and like butteriness in there. Like just yummy pastries that just smell amazing. I also have the body cream to the kitchen and the pumpkin spice latte and their body ganache is really really yummy too um it's like all natural ingredients and things like that pretty much so yeah i think besides the preservative it's all natural it has like cocoa butter and shea butter mango seed butter sweet almond oil sunflower oil vitamin e it's just nice stuff so i i usually get a bunch of these during the fall and winter because they just smell so good. Um, these are my three newest ones, and this is in the latest collection from Solstice Scents: Blackburn's Parlor, Sycamore Sugar Works, and Maine Moon. So Blackburn's Parlor, this is like waffle cone, chocolate and vanilla ice cream, and then they mix in like some banana and some other nice uh, things in I think there may be whipped cream in here too. And my favorite thing about this perfume is that you can actually smell the banana and it's not overpowering. Sometimes I think that banana notes and fragrances smell a little artificial and I don't really like it, but this is awesome. I also have the body cream and the whip soap to that one because, I don't know, I like to layer my scents, they smell good. Uh, the Sycamore Sugar Wars is pretty, it's similar. To the kitchen, um, it's also supposed to be like baked goods in the kitchen, but then it has like caramelized pear tarts, and I think there's like cream puffs, and I can really smell the pear in this one. So I would say both of those are gourmand, like really desserty, but then they have a little bit of a fruit note in them too. So if you like fruity smells, I think you'll like those a little bit more instead of just straight gourmand. Uh, the main moon, this is a yummy one. It it's a little different though. I would not call, this is not just like a straight up gourmand smell. This is supposed to be like reminiscent of a drive-in movie date or something like that. So it's like chocolate and popcorn, but then there's also like smoke and woodsy smell. So this one out of all of them, I would say is a little bit more unisex. I can smell the sweet notes, but overall I would say this is a pretty uh, smoky one. Uh, this is actually not my favorite. I still like it, but you guys know that I love to smell like straight up dessert and my dog is having a coughing fit and I wish he would stop. Why are you coughing? Moving on. So also for Solstice Scents a lot of the time, if they have the whipped soap available, I get those too. So this one is Sycamore Sugar Works. I have the whipped soap for Kitchen, the Blackburn's Parlor, the Main Moon. I have like all of them. I usually get these instead of using body wash because you just take this whipped soap and put like a dollop on your poof and just lather it up just like regular soap and um, I think it's easier especially if you're going to travel with this instead of a thing of body wash because I don't know about you guys but my body wash is always spilling in my suitcase um, luckily I put it always put it like in a plastic bag but it spills so much it annoys me 
Alright, moving on. I got a few more. Uh, actually, five more. So, one of the other things I love about fall is that Revee's cookie scent comes back. Turn up! Um, in the summer, they like to switch to a pineapple scent, and then they switch it out with a cookie in the fall. I love this scent. I know um, not everyone loves it. It doesn't smell like a sugar cookie. It's more like a ginger snap. It's a little bit of a spicier cookie, and I really like that kick that it has to it. This is one of my favorite butters. And the funny thing is, I've had this for like a year and I barely use any of it. Not because I don't use it, but just because I only need like a little bit of a fingerful when I'm using it. So, not that much is going to be gone. This is the problem. Problem? Maybe not really a problem. I have with all of my butters. It, it takes me like a year to use like two ounces of butter just because I just use a little bit. Um, this one is from Basque. It is their Truffle Butter Balm. This is mandarin truffle, so it's orange chocolate. It reminds me of those uh, chocolate oranges that you give to people like as gifts a lot of the time, like in gifts back to it's during the holidays and things like that. So that's why that's included in here. It smells amazing. As always, like basically anything from Bass smells amazing, but that's a good one. Also from Bass, I have the Plantain Spice Warming Body Butter. This one is seasonal. Um, the mandarin truffle is not, you can get that all year round. But this one, it's like spicy, kind of has like plantain, a little bit of a coconut, like nutmeggy smell. I like this one. This is a similar texture actually to the Reve body butter. Very like smooth, creamy butters, not gritty at all. I use both of those. Actually, I use all three of those butters on my body and my hair because they're natural butters and they work really well either way. Uh, this one is from CC's Naturals. This is pumpkin pie butter. This is a very whipped butter. It's very it's very different from the other three butters that I just showed because this is a very whipped um, shea butter. No, it's based in mango butter and shea butter and then it has avocado, coconut, rice bran, grapeseed, flax, and castor oil. This is a nice one as well when you uh, first touch it. You think it may be like a little too greasy, but it quickly, you know, dissipates and absorbs and I really, really appreciate that. No one wants to walk around with like a greasy body ever uh, <laughs> or greasy hair. I'm not a fan. So that's a nice one. Then the last one, obviously not least, this is really like the only hair product I have. Well, you know, you can also use like the pumpkin. Uh, conditioner from Darcy's Botanicals. I didn't bring that in here with me, but that one smells just like pumpkin pie. So that one always reminds me of fall, winter, Thanksgiving, Christmas, pumpkin pie, turn up. Um, and then this one smells like chocolate. It's a sweet cocoa bean curl smoothing cream. So I use this as a leave-in or a refresher. And this one smells like cocoa pebbles. Anytime I think of chocolate, I think of, you know, winter hot chocolate, things like that. So that's why I included this. And they are delicious. Um, if you guys have a favorite scent that you like to wear in the fall and winter, and especially if it smells like dessert, let me know because I am always open to smelling like dessert, smelling like cake, cookies, and pie. Uh, so that is pretty much all I have. Thank you so much, and I will talk to you guys later.